Hey, welcome to this week's Take That Hill. I encourage you to wait until the end of this video to meet our new friend, Eddie. All right, so where are we? Uh, South Mountain Institute Road through Oak Grove, Baptist, just on the uh, South west Mountain side of Children's Homes, right down the road too. It. It's an old orphanage. Yeah, so this is yep. South Mountain Institute Road. This is Oak Grove Baptist, I believe. Yeah, do that. So just on the uh, at the mouth of the Linda Gorge. Yeah, right near the mouth. So short off Mountain, right that way. Okay. Yeah, right here. So um, anyhow, if you ever been to Western North Carolina, that's some of the cool stuff you can see around here. And we're training today for Take That Hill. So this week, new sponsor, um, Command Sergeant Major Stephen Johnson, retired AGR from the North Carolina National Guard in the 30th Infantry Brigade. No, no, he was an artilleryman. He's gonna get mad at me. But anyhow, he's retired and um, started a construction company called Cross Cannons and they came on this week to sponsor this event. And so thank you, Stephen. It's freaking awesome. So uh, we're really grateful to you. God bless you. And we're going to put your logo on some stuff. Yep, so right there, that's Limbo Gorge. Over on the other side of that ridge. So if you've ever hiked in there, you can get lost in there. Just ask my friend Frazier. All right, so we got a new piece of equipment here today. Why don't you tell us a I little did. bit about that piece of equipment, about this thing right here, and how is this gonna help you climb 10,000 feet for veterans, Rambo? Ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to you the Specialized S-Works Mirror Saddle. At 193 grams, this is 3D printed, plastic injected, carbon reinforced uh, saddle that's going to help me climb that mountain 16 <laughs> times and it's going to be good for this rear end here <laughs> on the bike for about six hours so i'm looking forward to it hey while you're at it why don't you thank a couple of bike shops in statesville north carolina absolutely first and foremost let me thank uh first flight bicycles from statesville north carolina for hooking me up with this beautiful seat yep. and also helping me out with the maintenance on this uh beautiful climbing rig thank you very much also want to appreciate uh, dave carlton also over at uh, crossroad cycling uh, for helping me out with all my nutritional needs and bike needs you guys have been fantastic thank you so much for supporting such a wonderful event look forward to working with you guys in the future peace boom yep so uh, oh <laughs> we just about had a wreck with a dog uh, so if you ever come to morganton they've got a really nice greenway morganton north carolina and burke county a really nice greenway out here come ride that we're finishing up for today just had a really good ride. Heard some great stories by my buddy Don Franklin, who grew up up here doing all kinds of shenanigans. And uh, so, uh, anyhow, uh, more to follow. Hello? Hey, that's Broad or the Catawba? Is this the Catawba River? Get the bridge over the river, the Greenway. This is a pretty awesome place here. So, uh, Morganton, North Carolina. Come ride it. Okay, we're rolling. I think we're rolling. Yeah, we're rolling. <laughs> okay, uh, uh, recap of, of uh, this is week six of Take That Hill training. So, what do we do today? And we uh, rode with our uh, brother Don. Yep. Iceman? The Iceman. 
Iceman, and uh, he introduced us to uh, Eddie on our route, didn't he? We did meet Eddie. We did meet uh, Eddie. And then everybody tuning in is going to get to actually meet Eddie and uh, a little bit after this. Yeah, looking so forward pretty, to that. Pretty awesome. So, uh, so Don took us out on some beautiful routes out to Morganton. Right around uh, Lake James. Oh, beautiful. Yeah. Beautiful. Over 4,000 feet elevation gain today. Over 50 miles. 50 miles, 55, 56 yeah. miles. So, uh, awesome fantastic ride. ride. Beautiful weather. Great training. Uh, and um, when we came home safely. Safely, yeah, that's right. right. All right. Uh, so, uh, we've got some people to thank. It's been a huge week with regard to sponsorship for Take That Hill. Awesome. Um, so, first off, um, Bike Law. Out of Charlotte, North Carolina, represent Bike Law is a nationwide thing. Did you know that? I did not know. It that. is That's nationwide. Amazing. So Bike Law represents uh, cyclists who get into accidents and need help. That's and awesome. so Bike Law of Charlotte, with uh, our friend Ann, Ann. Uh, has uh, graciously agreed to sponsor Take That Hill. Right on Ann Ann, and Bike Law. And, and right on Bike Law, right? And uh, so Ann and Jana. Uh, Jana is her uh, paralegal down there. They've been doing the um, suicide awareness, 22 push-ups oh, a day awesome. thing, and they're putting that on their on their Facebook page. I think so, I saw that. Yeah, yeah it's pretty awesome. cool. So they're so it's funny because Ann started out her push-ups were a little a little sketchy <laughs> to begin, but she's on like day 19 now. Wow! And she's destroying those progress. Things, right? She's getting strong. So. Right on. Uh, uh, way to go, Ann. Awesome job. Good job, Ann. All right. And so, and then, and then, oh, big thing this week, too. Not just Bike Law, but man, reach out to uh, Eric Hill, uh, who is the founder of Project Echelon. And Project <laughs> Echelons uh, is a, they are a Cat One, like we get paid to ride bicycles, oh, pro amazing. racing team. Amazing. And they take money that they, earn and win and from their sponsors and then they support veteran nonprofits and so they came on this week as a, an official sponsor of Take That Hill and for Purple Heart Homes uh, and oh by the way we're in trouble because they're sending like either three or five pro riders what? to come ride with us right so wow. so we're gonna get crushed Okay, I awesome. told Eric I had a conference call with him this week and I was like look man you send some guys just remind them that we're all we were all born either in the early 70s or or in the 60s before the Tet Offensive in Vietnam and he didn't know what that was so uh, right right on I, Team Echelon so yeah awesome. Team Echelon so they support stuff like Save a Warrior and and then they have a really cool thing where they do a bike grant every year so if you're a veteran and you're wanting to and uh, using physical fitness to recover from whatever it is you can apply for a grant and they have a partnership with a bike manufacturer up in canada oh, awesome. exactly. and That's and the so veteran cool. essentially can get a brand new bike carbon fiber bike with all Ooh. the bells and whistles uh for uh 75 percent off wow or 70 percent off it's yeah. it's pretty cool so if you just go that. and google team echelon uh on on your google uh, i'll put some links in the thing you know the youtube thing down below whatever it is that is so we'll do awesome. that so uh, but it's been a been a uh, been an awesome week and more sponsors to come um we have our team kits will be finished the design will be finished on those yeah, so far I they love will be I see. I love the it. team kits will be they're going to be a like a cool camo pattern they will be available to purchase we're going to get extra sets they will be available to purchase uh and those will be at some point down the way on the purple heart homes e-store and if you want to check that out go to phhusa.org so I guess the other big thing is too, uh, I talked a little bit about last week, but we are going to be carrying American flags in honor of veterans uh, up the hill, uh, the 16 times up the mountain uh, when we ride. So uh, if you are interested and you have a veteran in your family or you are uh, have a veteran maybe that passed away uh, that you love and you wanna, you wanna sponsor a flag to go to the top of Barrett Mountain, you're welcome to do that and we'll have some information again that'll be coming awesome. out but you get that's how you can support this event you can you can uh, 
buy, essentially buy a flag to go to the top of the hill. And what you'll get for that, for your donation to support Take That Hill and essentially supporting veterans all around the country, uh, is you'll get, you'll get the flag that, that someone will carry to the top of the hill and you'll get a certificate of appreciation uh, that'll, that'll come with that, that'll say uh, this flag was taken to the top of Barrett Mountain in honor of your loved one. So uh, that's, that's pretty awesome. cool. That's and awesome. uh, yeah, yeah, man, I'm pretty excited about that. What a great so, idea. Uh, but uh, anyway, it's gonna be a great event, man. And yeah. gosh, we're uh, to it. almost like, uh, what, three months out? Is it three months yeah, now? July. Yeah, yeah. Well, August, three yeah, months, three months yeah. from today. Wow. It's three months from today, so we gotta get busy. That's just right around the corner. It's right around the corner. So, uh, uh, you got anything to add? No, I just wanna thank, uh, thank you for, for helping put this together. And uh, I'm really enjoying myself. I really appreciate uh, what the what we've got going on for the training and, yeah. and all the documentation that you put together and these videos. And I love it. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. And uh, man, full steam ahead for the next three months. Yeah, it's gonna be full steam ahead. And then yeah. we got to figure out what we're gonna do after we get this done. What's our next thing? Yeah, I'm sure we'll find something. What are we gonna do? Yeah, y'all y'all stay thinking, tuned because yeah. it's just gonna get bigger and better, man. It's gonna yeah, be awesome. It's gonna get bigger and better. Awesome. So, uh, <laughs> Hey, uh, so if you're out there watching, uh, our friend Parker, who works at Purple Heart Homes, our chief operations officer, is in the hospital now, uh, struggling with some health issues. So, um, man, uh, I would ask and plead with you to pray for Parker, because uh, we love him. Uh, he is so annoying <laughs> each and every day. But man, I love the guy, right? <laughs> he, he's, he's like a little Irish fireball. And, and uh, just- for Parker. Gosh, I mean, he's just so lovable and aggravating at the same time. You ever met anybody like that? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> just one. Uh, right, just, just one. one. Okay. Just one. So y'all pray for Parker. So, hey, thanks, everybody. Have a great week. We'll see you next week. Peace.